Good morning, wonderful people. Hi. I said good morning, it's not morning. It is um one going to two o'clock, it's like 1.30. So yesterday was cool. I want to start off by saying I enjoyed it a lot more than I thought I would. Initially I was I was like happy. Like when I was just doing my hair, I was like, oh I'm proud, I'm finally doing something that I've always wanted to do. Um and then I'm doing it. Yes, it took all day, I didn't mind. Can we just talk about how um three hours worth of footage, three to four hours worth of footage was condensed into 39 seconds? Excuse me? 39 seconds? I was there for three hours. I wanted you guys to see it like a little bit more. I guess it's a time lapse, but maybe they were like the way you just fly through them them clips. Anyways, when I was still doing my hair, that was cool. Then I woke up to my mum's. Now, remember how I said there was construction happening at my mum's? The house is a bombsite, babe. Like, literally, there's no space to move in the house because everything in Ria's room is scattered all over the living room. So there's no space in the living room. It's all cramped up. The things in the bathroom are all in the kitchen. They needed to paint the uh, corridors and my sister's room. So everything's just everywhere. So I'm like, right. My mum and Ria are there half passed out on the sofa because they've been waiting for me all evening pretty much. Well, Ria finishes work finished work at eight o'clock um my mum had been in the house all day because she was with the painters and whoever were like doing what they needed to do and um yeah so when I showed up at 12 on the dot or 11 59 basically I showed up and it wasn't my birthday no more I could tell they were annoyed but I was on the I was given off the energy that I warned you guys I didn't want everything squashed into today because I knew that everyone would be tired they wouldn't be putting their best foot forward or presenting their best versions of themselves like they wouldn't be ready to you know be happy birthday have a go look, look. you know they wouldn't have that kind of energy they're tired they're hungry as well because they hadn't eaten because we were meant to go out i was like i'm gonna do my hair i'm gonna enjoy myself i'm gonna chill i'm not gonna rush even though i was rushing <laughs> I'm not gonna rush, I'm gonna take my time, I'm gonna get there when I get there and whatever happens, happens. We got there and they're giving off, they're laughing about me being late and them being tired. They even messaged me to say, oh, don't even come anymore. I didn't see those messages, thank God I didn't because that would have irritated me. Because I said last week, do I need to prepare? Are there dinner reservations? No. Is there anything planned for us to do today? No. So I'm about to rush down, get ready to come sit in the house, in a cramped house. Everyone's just sitting sprawled out. Like it's not it's not giving. Like this is my twenty first. Like if I said I didn't want anything to happen, if I wanted to spend the day by myself, I could have very much spent the day by myself and enjoyed it however I wanted to because I was doing what I wanted. But then everyone's like, Oh, you know, it's your twenty first, your mum. So it's like, okay, fine, you can go down to my mum's but we're gonna be showing up late. Like I wanna do my hair. And I felt good to living that feeling for a bit. But as soon as I stepped into the house, the energy licked me and it's like, <sighs> imagine if I didn't do what I wanted to do. I would be fuming right now. I was upset because it is still, still sad about the day in general, but that on top of it, I was thinking, Renee, we're not going to let it happen if they're feeling a little like selfish in the minute because they're tired, they're hungry. They've been waiting. <laughs> like, th what was annoying me was the fact that they were like, oh no, you have to come down so you can do the cake. I'm like, every minute, cake, 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 cake. I don't care. Like, I could, this could have very easily be done, been done on Friday. And they're like, no, it's not gonna be as fresh. I'm like, how is the birthday duck girl telling you they don't care about what's gonna happen, but you're telling me that it has to happen. But I'm like, I don't care. I want it done on such and such a day. I'm very much happy for it to happen on such and such a day because things are actually planned. We actually have cinema tickets booked. We're actually going to be going out and doing something versus sitting in the house and looking at each other, twiddling thumbs. But they weren't trying to hear that regardless as I was with family. It did mellow out. So once they woke up a bit, we did cut the cake. Um, we went to McDonald's, ate McDonald's, came home actually cut the cake so i did the candles first and then we cut the cake and then there was a whole hubbub about um cutting the cake because listen my auntie makes cakes right she's the cake maker of the family literally cake business 
boom bada bing bada boom her cakes are magnificent so and then i asked for a hummingbird cake as well because i know when it comes to that cake my dad has this like <laughs> protection over the blooming cake where it needs to be shared and it's always my cake when it's my cake the cake or ria's cake or our cakes they always get cut up and distributed throughout the family i have a very big family not very big a relatively big family there's a lot of people so my dad has two sisters and a brother those are three separate families i on my mother's side have well to be honest on my, my mum's side they don't really like have cake they all live outside of london and the ones that live here aren't really like they don't too fussed about the cake but then we have my mum so that's three families plus a cake for my dad's house and a cake for my mum's house that's five separate households that are trying to get a slice of this cake and it's not a slice it's a chunk to last okay i'm not trying to cut the cake or am i here distributing cake when i haven't even been able to have a slice of the cake because we had mcdonald's i was full of mcdonald's i didn't really want the cake it was like 2 a.m at this point like i'm not supposed to be eating right now my belly should have closed like mm, eight hours ago but it's here being opened for a reason i don't know i just didn't want to be cutting and giving like delegating cake off to everyone where it's like not to be that person but when it's their birthdays babes i don't see cake for nothing i don't get a slice i don't get a smell i don't get a look i don't know what the cake looks like i don't know anything and every year it happens every with everyone but when it's mine that is like so we kind of we go cut it we cut cake it's really not about what i want because if i had it my way i'd have the cake whole i'd cut it and eat it when i wanted to and whoever comes to the house to visit then i'd offer cake that's how it's supposed to go and that's kind of how it went this time but not really because the hummingbird cake stayed at my mom's fair enough that's fine that stayed there and then my auntie's cake came with me to, to my dad's tell me why i'm waking up this morning <laughs> my uncle's downstairs <laughs> <laughs> to be fair he was like saying happy birthday again and gave me my gift which is that chakoy i got the papers can you guys see i got the papers I got, the cake's heavy and it was big so i cut that one across and i cut the one on top no i cut the one on top across and the one at the bottom um i cut some off and left some at my mum's my mum's not really too fussed about that cake ever then cut it in half and then that's how it was in the fridge go down downstairs and one of the <laughs> halves of the berliner cake has been eaten my dad my dad had the cake this morning bearing in mind i was downstairs and it was literally just one so i'm like all right <laughs> the cake the first thing all right like okay um and then he's cutting some for my uncle why is this slice what listen when i tell you these chunks are fat like the chunk is fat like it's a fat slab like a slice is you don't need a lot of the cake honestly because it's there's better because there's so many levels i mean so many layers in within that one cake you could have like a, a slither and it would be the equivalent of having a thick slice so why he literally the cake slab that my dad cut for my uncle is like it looked like a mini book like This was the th the thickness, okay? So imagine seeing this a slab like this on the table. Okay, ignore that much. So you're just seeing thick, thick slab like this in tin foil, tin foil. Because my uncle's like, yeah, can I slice? I'm like, yeah, I'm like, yeah, whatever. And then my dad's like, come, come, cut it. I'm like, daddy, I don't care. Just cut the cake. Cut the cake that you're taking. Like it's it's out of my hand now, kind of thing. Like I'm not involved. Bruv, I should have been involved because what was that? what was that chunky chunky off chunked off slab of cake not no slice slab not no slice a slab bruh never have i ever in my life and i'm just like where is this energy when it's everybody out like <laughs> that was today but what i was talking about before was the early hours of this morning um I did finish my hair. I don't think I've shown you guys properly. I thought the time, the, oh my God. 
not not the not the baby this is why i didn't do baby hairs because what the heck is that i'm breaking off the scarf and i'm looking like a hot mess like what is that like i don't ever do my baby hairs because i always think i look stupid like what is this wispy stuff i prefer when it's just a little little fuzz little fuzz i didn't get to show you guys really look at me purr she cute or whatever she cute or whatever guys why have i woken up this morning and my auntie's already put in an order for me to do her hair yeah why is this why is this a thing hmm? my mom must have taken pictures of me yesterday and sent it to her without my consent yeah they like to do that and she's like yeah it looks so good the way i had to defend myself because babes the pic i know the picture did not show the back what is that and i'm like yeah 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 it's cool thank you so much ha 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 whatever um yeah i'd love to try um it took me a really long time this is what i bought this is what i use this is what you'll need um see you on the 26th so i guess i'll be doing my hair my auntie's hair on the 26th she was like yeah the braids look neat um on the camera or in the photo or whatever and don't i i need to fix them now so that's kind of what i'm gonna do yeah i also need to recurl them and cut some of these because the the curling rods i bought that one pound 99 rubbish is literally one pound 99 rubbish like it's just there's just too much hair and they're all different sizes and silly me just realized that um if i'm redoing them i shouldn't have cut the hair i should have redone it and then cut the hair i need to redo this one because again this one's giving not this one i was gonna say this one's giving knotless but this looks odd <laughs> like this one looks neater but you can see the rubber band you're not supposed to see the rubber band babes like it's just not giving what it's supposed to give like some i did good and others like this thing like what is that what is that no guys dime que lo que what is, what is this this and then you have this <laughs> oh, what are we doing what are we doing sir ma'am <laughs> what is that like why are you so thick what have you been eating but you can, you can tell i tried i tried i tried um yeah in terms of gifts gifts so i've just showed you my uncle gave me the papers i showed you what my brother sister renee got me then my auntie along with the cake that means alcohol they love to gift alcohol like i i don't i don't know if that's a culture thing or not but everybody get me alcohol ladies. girl oh yeah the bean bag you guys saw and then my mom oh and ria I've got me this like self help book. Listen, all I'm saying is that she did good because this is very on brand. Therapy. Yeah. <laughs> the tools shared in this book are mostly taught in therapy, but they are not therapy skills. They are life skills, tools that can help every single one of us navigate through difficult times and to flourish. When we understand a little bit about how our minds work and we have some guides guidepost on how to deal with our emotions in a healthy way we not only build resilience but we can thrive and grow i need to start reading more so this is good so this is what Rue got me i love that for us like she got it good she was like i hope you like it i hope it's thoughtful she did very good this year and then my mum my mum and dad i guess the whole family my dad liked to pretend like he wasn't involved but this is for my mum bruh they booked me a 12 mile themed flight for two. Bruh, a helicopter experience, bruh. A 12 mile themed helicopter flight for two. When I just read that just now, helicopter wasn't on the page. And I was thinking, why doesn't it say helicopter? So my eyes probably just bugged up right now. Or that's a glitch in the matrix because I, in my head I was thinking, why doesn't it say helicopter on the page? This is literally, like I saw, like I read this yesterday, it said helicopter. Why does it say helicopter now? And then, but that's what I was thinking as I was reading it. And I'm like, was it always that short? Like, was the words always, and then I'm opening it and it says 12 mile themed helicopter flight. And I look at it and I'm like, 
How did I miss helicopter right there on the page? That was a glitch. If only you guys, if only the page was turned, you probably would have seen what I was talking about. And a crystal maze life experience for two, London, anytime. That's so cool. I guess we fly in next year, guys. Obviously, I'll have to take you along to both experiences. Who am I going to take with me is what was riddling my mind because do I take my sister or do I take Faith? But I haven't spoken to Faith. Well, I have. She did say happy birthday. Um, and so did Nicole, but I mean, I haven't seen or spoken to them in, I mean, haven't seen them in a real life in like five years. So do I extend an olive branch or, or what? Guys, I got another ginger shot off my mum. Apparently she, this was her last one, but she let me have it because it's my birthday. And I did not be like, oh no, mummy, have it. No, no, it's fine, I don't need it. I said, yoink. Even though I'm not a fan of fruit flavored things, I'm like, let's try, it's cherry. And it's a shot, so let's try. We're trying turmeric today. This is probably what gonna taste good, but shake, 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 shake your water. Oh, it's actually turmeric. Oh god, it stinks. I just realised this is actually <laughs> turmeric. I used to brush my teeth with turmeric when I was trying to be like, oh, you know, self-care days. Yeah, let's see what, um, what, um, if, you know, you know what I'm trying to say? Like, I was doing face masks and stuff. Anyway, three, two, one, down hatch. Ah, ha, ha. Oh. That's turmeric, all right. Not horrid. Tastes like zesty, like lemony. No, yeah, it's not bad. Now I'm gonna see if I can fix my hair. And then I'm gonna go eat some fried rice. And I'll see you guys later. I will be trying to vlog now. Now that the birthday's passed, I feel a lot more calm. Jesus, actually I need to redo this too because what in the hell? I need to do that one again. I need to do that one again. Like this one's not bad. Some of these aren't bad. I think I just didn't understand the technique of how to braid the extension over my real hair. I don't know, I'm gonna have to remove some hair from a lot of these too, so. But I guess, it's not always going to be perfect because it's my first time and everyone starts from somewhere not me trying to make myself feel better about the situation like i need to do this one again the way it's just hanging and everything it's not even in the right placement this one is fine but this one is not and i was also thinking about hairstyles i could do could i do three and then just have this dangling like this and like this <laughs> Like when my mom saw me, she was like, yeah, like it's a, it's a good effort. And I'm like, you know why you said that. But anyways, yeah, let's fix these braids. I'm going to start from the back and work my way up to the front. So I'll see you guys later. See, like, what is this? What, like, what was I doing? I guess I was tired. Um, yeah, I'll see you guys later. Bye.